what is virtual dome what is the difference between dome and virtual dome in the previous questions i explained dome so whenever a user will do any changes in application then basically we are updating the real dome right now what is virtual dome and why do we even need it first of all dome is a journal and real concept in all the browsers without it your website or application can't interact even interact or handle javascript but virtual dome is only specific to react only and it's not mandatory it is developed uh, developed by facebook for react just to improve the um, speed of the applications okay basically there is a performance problem there in the real room dome the problem is even if a user makes a very small change to the web application in the browser even then the whole layout will be still be rendered in the dome whole layout okay whole rendering will happen for example as a user you are just changing one element title text here in the title tag in html even then the browser will recalculate and re-render the whole layout of the entire page which will basically then re refresh or in other words you can say refresh the entire dome which is very time consuming that time consumption will increase the load time of the web page and that is the speed or performance problem to solve this problem we have virtual dome now listen carefully in react application if some website user open a react web based website in their browser then in the background react libraries will make an exact copy of the dom and show that copy to the user in front of user not the real dom okay so this exact copy of real dom is we call virtual dom now when the user will do some interaction some manipulations to the elements in the html then from outside it looks like the user is interacting to the real dome but in actually actually the user is interacting and making the changes with this virtual dome which is the exact copy of the real dome only and the speciality of virtual dome is if user is changing any element in html now then virtual dome will not render the whole virtual dome for small small changes only the small specific part of virtual dome will be updated and then in the background the react algorithms only of the react library will keep comparing the changes between virtual dome and real dome and whatever changes the user has made here in the virtual dome only those changes will be updated in the react uh, real dome by those algorithms by the react library great this is the whole process and this update process from virtual dome to real dome is also called reconciliation okay which is done by react libraries great so earlier we were directly updating the real dome which was a single step process but now in react first virtual dome and then real dome will be updated it's a two-step process but yes now rather than re-rendering the whole dome directly now we are updating only the changed elements in the virtual dome and same in the real dome this minimum rendering of dome makes your web page very fast to load in the ui the conclusion is react uses a virtual dome to efficiently update the ui without re-rendering the entire page will which helps in improving the performance and make the application more responsive great now whatever i have explained based on that here are the four differences between dome and virtual dome either you can pause the screen and i already explained it you can pause the screen and read them or you can refer this book later for quick revision also